Skip again. I'm going to be doing another reaction again. And this time I'm going to react to the crowd. Yeah, yeah, I went to five. And this time I'm going to react to this one video called Review Lay's Crunch Tater Potato Chips. Hmm. So yeah, I'm going to react to it. React. I'm going to react to it. So before I even start, I want to give a disclaimer. If you do not like the content I make, the reaction feels, or any of the other stuff I do on my channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch and go somewhere else. Because the only thing you're gonna be doing is giving me a view, and that's the damn truth, Ron. So that's the damn truth, and nothing but the truth. So yeah, so now without further ado, let's get to the video. Right now, let's get to it right now. Today we're gonna try Lay's Crunch Taters. Which apparently is a throwback. I saw. I was in Dollar General just buying something else. I was buying tortillas because I'm gonna uh, take the turkey from my Thanksgiving dinner and put taco seasoning on it, make tacos out of that. So that'll date this video. Today is in fact Saturday, but uh, not when the video goes up. Anyway, I saw these at my Dollar General. They looked like a retro package. I'd never heard of them before. Uh, I looked them up. I found a website. Uh, let me try to pull it up on my iPad here. That has a whole history fact on it. So. The guy who wrote this, shout out to you. Huh. This is snackhistory.com. Huh. It might be hard to see, but anyway, snackhistory.com has a whole write-up about the history huh. of crunch taters, which were around apparently in the 80s and 90s, and you can buy them for 69 cents a bag, and apparently huh. they're kind of like um, kettle chips. They're kind of like pseudo-kettle chips before kettle chips were kind of a thing, huh. as they are now. There was this one and a mesquite barbecue flavor. I opted for the original, $3.60 uh, at Dollar General, or two for six. I probably should have got the two for six and done both, but I decided not to because I didn't huh. want to spend six bucks. So I just got the one Lay's Crunch Taters to try. It says right here, throwback crunchies. That's so good. Crunchiness, that's so good. You got your Crunch Tater Man. Tater Man? I guess that's just an alligator, or... Or is it? No, it's gotta be an alligator. It's crunch taters. I don't know. I was about to say crocodile. So forget everything I just said. Let's just uh, look at them and taste them. Oh, you know what these remind me of? Munchos. If you've ever had munchos from like a gas station, they're kind of like, you know, they're like potato chips, but they're not. They have a weird texture anyway. These look very much like munchos in that sense. And munchos aren't exactly kettle chips. Kettle chips have more of a hard crunch. Munchos are more of a soft crunch, which I do like munchos. So I'm very curious to see how the crunch on these go. So let's take a couple chips and uh, see what happens. Honestly, these crunch taters are kind of a boring review. Now that I'm thinking about it in hindsight, I probably should have got the mesquite barbecue. Because these are very similar to kettle chip lays and regular oh, lays. Yeah. If you look at the ingredients, you literally have three ingredients. Potatoes, vegetable oil, and sea salt. That's all there is to it. Oh. It's just the way it's cooked. Mm -hmm. These are interesting. They're basically like a kettle chip, but oh. slightly thinner. It's almost like they're as thin as they could get a kettle chip and fried it. Which makes the crunch a little better to me than a kettle chip. Because I specifically don't like the hard kettle chip crunch. It, like I feel like oh. I'm going to break a tooth when I'm eating them. Um, and these are a little bit of a lighter crunch, if that makes sense, but they're still very, very, very crunchy. They're on the edge of being a kettle chip, essentially. Huh. Just a little bit thinner, which kind of takes the edge off of the crunch factor, even though they're supposed to be, you know, extra crunch, which they are compared to regular Lay's, but compared to kettle chips, not exactly. They're kind of a middle batch, and I think that's a great idea, and some people probably really like these, but as somebody who doesn't really like kettle chips, this is not going to be, you know, great for me. I'll still eat the rest of this bag. They're still they're still good potato chips. They have mm -hmm. a good taste. They have that Lay's, you know, classic Lay's saltiness taste. Mm. Nice salty potato chips, but mm. I wouldn't buy these again because I don't prefer mm. the extra crunch, honestly. I like mm. a thin Lay's that kind of just melts. Uh, mm. That's that's my preference. So if you like kettle chips, definitely try out these crunch taters. Mm. They're interesting in that form. Mm. I kinda, Again, I wish I'd gotten the mesquite barbecue because that at least would have been a different flavor. I assume mm -hmm. it's different than regular Lay's barbecue, but, you know, who knows? You yeah. probably have to do a video to find out. Maybe maybe I will eventually, but yeah. for now, here we go, crunch taters. I'll give them a solid 4 out of 5 because mm. they are good, solid potato yeah. chips. I just don't prefer the form factor, but I, I like it, and I'll finish the rest of the bag. Mm. So that's the information. Maybe check out the Mesquite Barbecue. Let me know if you like it. I'd really be curious to know, and I will see you all next time. Yeah. So, yeah, that's the end of the video. And I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the video on every time I upload it. And share my videos, react videos to your friends, family, also if you want to, it's your choice. Because I ain't making you. So yeah. And don't forget to subscribe to Corrupt. Uh,
Yeah, I want to five if you new subscribe to his channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, give me a subscribe. Subscribe. And run the road, the two K scrubbers, and maybe three K scrubbers. But right now, run the road, the two K scrubbers right now. Two K right now. So yeah, I hope we get in it. And uh see y'all for more banger reacts for the game. And I'll see you all in the next time. Jeff Joy and Sign out. And Pizza Store Legends. And Merry Christmas month. And peace out, everyone.